October 25, Friday of the 29th week in Ordinary Time A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke Jesus said to the crowds, When you see a cloud rising in the west, you say immediately that it is going to rain, and so it does. And when you notice that the wind is blowing from the south, you say that it is going to be hot, and so it is. You hypocrites, you know how to interpret the appearance of the earth and the sky, why do you not know how to interpret the present time? Why do you not judge for yourselves what is right? If you are to go with your opponent before a magistrate, make an effort to settle the matter on the way, otherwise your opponent will turn you over to the judge, and the judge hand you over to the constable, and the constable throw you into prison. I say to you, you will not be released until you have paid the last penny. The Gospel of the Lord How to Interpret the Present Time Jesus challenges the multitudes following Him to learn how to interpret correctly. Jesus uses the familiar imagery of the weather to drive home His point. He sounds harsh in calling the crowds hypocrites for not being able to interpret the present time while they know the implications of the cloud rising, wind blowing, and dawn coming. They should also know the meaning of His presence. The present time referred to by Jesus is Kairos, which is His time, the messianic time, time to change, time of salvation and redemption. When Jesus is with them, it is time to listen to Him. Not only that, they must know the moral implications of his teachings. Jesus speaks as a spiritual teacher whose mission is to bring people back to God in their present situation. Millions of people are migrating today to other countries for a better future or to take refuge in safer grounds. They are running away from violence, war, and catastrophe. God wants our well-being, our salvation now. God is Lord also of migrants.